Since marriage, we're exceptionally vulnerable. We should be treated with compassion. Spain's centre-right People's Party has reached an agreement with the far-right anti-immigrant Vox Party, enabling a PP-led coalition to take power in the southern region of Andalusia, a bastion of socialism. Danny Eberhard reports, this agreement has two striking effects. It allows the People's Party to unseat the socialists in Andalusia for the first time in 46 years. And it cements Vox, the first far-right party. Citizens. The agreement talks in general terms of things close to Vox's heart, including combating fundamental Islam. But it's less specific on tackling illegal immigration than Vox is claiming. This is the world news from the BBC. The far-right Italian Deputy Prime Minister Matteo Salvini has called on populists from Italy and Poland to launch what he called a new European Spring to replace the centre-right influence of Germany and France. Speaking during a visit to Warsaw, Mr. Salvini said the European elections due in May would be vital to create a reformist bloc to overhaul Brussels institutions from within. Iran has acknowledged for the first time that a U.S. citizen was arrested in the country last month. The spokesman for the Iranian Foreign Ministry said the U.S. government has been informed of the arrest of Michael White in the city of Mashhad. The Mexican president, under